Hi everyone, I'm Jim Hamrant, the Managing Editor of Medical Design Outsourcing, and I'm here to take you through some of our top stories of 2022. How many of us had any idea one year ago what 2022 would bring? There were exciting and encouraging developments in medtech innovation, big challenges from supply chain and labor shortages, and spin-offs, purchases, and partnerships among the biggest names in the industry. As we venture into 2023, let's take a look at just seven of MDO's top stories of 2022, based primarily on reader engagement at our website, via our email newsletters, and on our LinkedIn page. Number one, the 2022 MedTech Big 100. MedTech businesses spinning off as standalone companies create some new names on the 2022 MedTech Big 100, our annual ranking of the world's largest medical device companies. The largest companies are still Medtronic, Johnson & Johnson MedTech, and Siemens Health and Ears, but our latest ranking also includes newly formed entities such as Innovus and ZimV. Number two, what is pulse field ablation? Here's what you need to know. Pulse field ablation is a non-thermal method for cardiac ablation that has the potential to positively disrupt the way atrial fibrillation is treated. Top experts at Boston Scientific, Medtronic, and Acutus Medical shared their insights about pulse field ablation's potential at Device Talks Boston. Number three, employees say Intuitive, Boston Scientific, J&J, and Medtronic are among the best places to work in 2022. The medtech industry's growth collided with a global labor shortage, and that gave the most in-demand talent more opportunities to choose where to work. This is definitely a trend to watch in 2023. Number four, why Afera's cardiac ablation technology is worth $1 billion to Medtronic. Afera's system diagnoses, maps, and treats heart arrhythmias with ablation. After Medtronic closed the deal, we spoke with leaders at both companies to learn how the devices work, the challenges to develop them, and what's next for the technology. Number five, 10 medical device startups you need to know. Some of the most interesting medical device startups of 2022 are advancing a wide range of innovative medtech, from robotics to catheter-delivered brain-computer interfaces and more. Companies like CMR Surgical, ND Addicts, and Moon Surgical has been making news since we post our list. Keep an eye on all of them in the months ahead. Number six, catastrophic explosion and resin shortage led Medtronic supply chain problems. Back in May, Medtronic CEO Jeff Martha blamed supply chain issues for the majority of the company's $350 million miss since fourth quarter. Shortages of semiconductors, resins, and packaging plagued others in the industry, with chips and resins still in high demand at the start of 2023. Number seven, what is nitinol and where is it used? Nitinol is a metal alloy of nickel and titanium with unique properties for medical applications, including super elasticity or pseudo elasticity and shape memory. That means nitinol can remember its original shape and return to it when it's heated. We've seen a ton of nitinol innovations this year and lots of interest from readers, so look for more of this sort of FAQ content from MDO in 2023. That about does it. For even more top stories of 2022, go to medicaldesignoutsourcing.com. I and the whole team at MDO and WTWH Media wish you a great 2023, and please remember to like, follow, and subscribe.